Hello Sagittarius, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your weekly tarot reading for the sign of Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising in Venus and it will be from the 5th to the 11th of April 2021. I hope you are Sagittarius. So I'm going to do these readings a couple of days early and um, with Easter coming I just thought it would be better. So let's pull your first card. What do we have for our lovely Sagittarians? Thank you. Literally just come out. <laughs> Oh, affirmations. Now that might be you putting positive energy out to the universe, very much linked to the law of attraction, positive affirmations. So it might well be you shaping your energy here. Um, you know, sometimes we need affirmations when we feel lack, don't we, in order to put the positive, to shape our energy, to turn something negative to positive. But you might also be getting some, I'm getting some some confirmation, some feedback, yeah. Let's see what we get, Sagittarius. You might be getting some feedback, confirmation. Affirmation of what you know to be true. Let's see what we get. What do we have for Sagittarius, please? Message for Sagittarius, thank you. Oh yeah, success. I'm getting feedback. Let's see what else we get, Sagittarius. <coughs> oh, okay. What do we have for Sagittarius, please? Angels, spirits, guides, message for our lovely Sagittarians. Thank you. 5th to the 11th of April 2021. So I'm going to pull three cards, then we'll clarify, go deeper into the message. You know, by now we always do. And it won't resonate with everybody. So just take what resonates with you, Sagittarius. Okay. Message for Sagittarius. Yeah, we have the eight of wands. Sagittarian energy as well. We've got the tower. Advice from spirit and your near future outcome. We have the three of wands. Okay, message for Sagittarius, please, angels, spirits, guides. Message for Sagittarius, thank you. We have the Six of Cups and the Page of Cups. Yeah. <laughs> oh, nice. The Eight of Wands with the Tower. And we have the Three of Pentacles with the Three of Wands. Eight of Swords is bottom of the deck. Yeah, Sagittarius, I'm definitely getting this energy of you've just been trying to move on. Um, I'm definitely getting this energy of breaking free, manifest um, positive change. Interestingly enough, this is an energy shift as well. So it could be linked to your own energy too. But, you know, this can be conversations, communication, feedback. Um I was getting feedback quite strongly, so I'm staying with that because it just seemed to resonate with me very well. You know, this can be conversations, communication, bringing a shift, forward movement, um, and allowing you to move on from the past. Could be in the form of some opportunity coming your way. Um, now that could be in terms of love, romance, relationships, that could be in terms of business, career. I'm also seeing this in terms of travel. So if you've been delayed in terms of, you know, some kind of travel, wanting to move overseas, um, if there's something to do with distance here, for some of you, it feels that you're going to get the shift. The shift is coming. And I like the energy so much. There's been a difficulty in breaking free of the past. But nevertheless, things the, the page of cups is things are about to lock up. It just it feels like there's been some delays. You haven't been hearing back from somebody. I'm, I'm getting feedback. So, you know, tell you what resonates with you, like I always say. 
but you are going to get the feedback and that's what spirit is telling you the feedback is going to come and it's going to be life-changing some kind of life-changing event which will allow you to break free of the old the past uh, tear down the old tower and rebuild a new one some of you might be moving home as well and like i said for some of you i was feeling travel uh, again some of you might be moving overseas travel i mean you know you could have had problems with visas um, this can also be in terms of money career finances as well for some of you that's what i'm feeling the most both of those things but it feels that things are about to look up again it definitely feels in this energy that there will be some significant feedback and significant change which will realign you to the path that i feel you really want to be on because it is linking in with success these energies remember the tower is a neutral energy you know i know i know some people see it as bad but it's actually not it is just the tearing down of the old it is aligning you to where you need to be and that's what the universe does so definitely in this energy it feels that some news is coming in that is tearing down the old um and it feels exactly what you want what you've been waiting for like i said for some of you i'm feeling travel overseas opportunities maybe moving overseas uh, or moving a significant distance it might even be you know for some of you you want to reconnect with somebody so it, it, it might well be you know whether you, you know you want to be near family or you're moving for other reasons yeah i mean you know like i i feel that that you're getting some the news that you've been waiting for the feedback that you've been waiting for is coming your way so the situation isn't futile sagittarius don't get too much in your own head you know the eight of swords is oh it's never going to happen i'm never going to break free i'm never going to hear anything <laughs> and you know there is definitely an energy of being too much in our own head with the eight of swords the swords can be to do with our mind our perceptions how we see something and it's how we put barriers how the mind just makes us feel restricted you know i'm, I'm never gonna get here back i don't think you know i'm gonna hear back i don't think it's going to be good news i don't think i'm going to break free of here well, the message is it, you are you are it's coming your way and it's allowing you to build a new tower um, and again some of you might be moving home this can be the beginnings of success in a new job or new career um, yeah the, these are the beginnings of success the first signs of success the first signs of things opening up for you and again, having some tangible result of your manifesting, your effort. The Three of Pentacles can be about teamwork, collaboration, partnerships. It can also be to do with doing up a new home property, you know, for me as a reader. Um, like I said, for some of you, uh, your ships are coming in. There's definitely an energy of it's, it's coming. So keep on going with this energy. With the Three of Wands, it's not quite in the harbour yet. But there's something good coming your way and you can see it on the horizon. So this could be, um, you can anticipate something good coming your way. And then, bam, Spirit is saying, there's the news that brings all the change. It feels in this situation, Sagittarius, that there is success. You know, these two cards are the beginnings of success. The first signs of success. Uh, whether it's to do with a new job, new home, new business partnership, this is the manifestation of success. Your efforts have not gone unrewarded. And I definitely feel in this instance, you know, there is some shift, some positive shift coming your way. So again, this energy of continue doing your own affirmations. For those of you who do energy affirmations, they're really working, by the way. Um... They are working. <laughs> um, but also, I feel for some of you, you're going to get something back. I'm getting feedback. Um, it feels very, very beautiful. Exciting energy. Okay. Yeah. Feeling inspired. 
we have inspiration be prepared as you'll soon receive a visit from the fairy of inspiration come dusk or dawn she can call at any time i'm definitely getting this feedback here that you've wanted i'm going to pull one more any other message for sagittarius please thank you i've got solitude uh, think of being alone as meaning you are all one in total harmony with everything. The greatest treasures are those that wait silently during your quiet times. I mean, again, for some of you, you might be reconnecting to somebody or might be wanting to reconnect to somebody um, or to be near somebody. You know, like I said, you know, whether you're moving to be near family or it's love or it's for business. Um, it definitely feels in this energy that you're getting aligned to where you need to be. It feels very beautiful indeed. So I hope you enjoyed the reading. If you did, please do like, share and subscribe. I hope it's a wonderful week for you all, Sagittarius, and I will see, see you next time. Thank you.